those who recognize when a new season is dawning and embrace it with gusto are the ones who will get the most out of life. That's a quote from Richard Blackaby in his book, The Seasons of God. I just left Andy and Nico at the airport. They're on their way back to Romania. God's got a great adventure for them. God's going to take care of them. Thank you for your prayers. I don't know about you, but my life has already entered a new season, and I love what God is doing. I love having two sons. I love having an international ministry, and I love God using my life's story to help others. Yes, a few days ago, I said goodbye to Andy and Nico for a while. They have returned to Romania to find jobs and pursue God's direction for their lives. We had an amazing six months that honestly, I didn't want to ever end. But those who recognize when a new season is dawning and embrace it with gusto are the ones who will get the most out of life. Please pray for our family. Pray specifically that God will direct Andy and Nico to the jobs he has waiting for them. And pray for me, that God will give my heart peace as I trust in him. You know, having your family spread across continents isn't very comforting. So, I've rearranged the furniture here in the house, and I'm looking toward the future with great expectation of what God is already doing. Furlough 2018. Yes, it's almost here. Just a few more weeks and I will be on a non-stop flight from Rome to Miami. I still need a ride from the airport when I land in Miami in late afternoon, January 31st, and I'll need to go to Plantation, Florida. If you could do that, just send me an email. That would be a great answer to prayer. Evening in Italy dinner meetings. This is a fundraising opportunity that I love to do. And I will be your host, and I will be your chef, and I will be your server. February 9th, which is a Friday night, Saturday, February 10th, 6.30 p.m. to 9.30 p.m., I'll be hosting six to 10 people. This space is limited, so make your RSVP reservations today. I've already got some reservations for both nights, so please, I don't want anyone to miss out. There is a suggested donation of $100, and online at missionroma.com, you can make that reservation, or you can bring it the evening of the event. But I need to know that you're coming. So please email me now, missionroma at live.com. Speaking opportunities are starting to materialize and the furlough calendar is coming together. If your church, your small group, young adults group, or even business would be interested in Justin's story or the vision of Mission Roma, please message me. 12 for 50. God gave me the idea taken from the life of the 12 apostles, 12 men God used to change the world with his message. In fact, you and I are born again today because of the faithfulness of those 12 men 2,000 years ago. 12 people 
pledging $50 monthly will greatly change the city of Rome. Mission Roma has been here in Rome for 10 years and we have plans of continuing this ministry until the Lord Jesus Christ returns. As seasons change, people feel led to devote their support in other directions. And at the beginning of the new year, starting with a fresh slate and looking ahead to what God has called Mission Roma here in Rome to do, I would simply ask you to pray and consider what God has called you to do. If it would be to partner with Mission Roma for this year, praise God, but somehow be involved with what God is doing globally until his return, which will be very, very soon. God bless you.